Alongside Havelina Jr. linebacker, Tremichael Tut, I'm Mark and Sarah for Havelina Athletics. Trey, you guys are a couple weeks in a summer camp, a couple weeks away from the start of the 2019 season here on September 7th. How intense has summer camp been for you guys so far? Well, camp's been really good for us. Let's just start off with that. Um, it's been very, very intense. You know, we came into camp a little out of shape. So Coach Wilkerson and definitely Coach Buff, they've been trying to get us in a lot of shape and, you know, just kind of speed that process up. Camp's been really good for us, though. They've done a lot of good things for us when trying to make sure that we stay as healthy as possible when going into September 7th. So that's definitely been a big thing for us as well. But camp's been very, very intense, and it's been very, very good for us right now. You guys had a scrimmage on last side. I thought the defense looked, looked pretty good. You guys forced a couple turnovers. So happy you've been with the way the defense has played so far and performed so far in camp. I've been, I've been very, very impressed with the defense. We have brought in a lot of JUCO guys that are going to help us this season, along with a lot of returning guys that we have back, Caleb Valentine, me, myself, Alec Lewis, Jalen Harrison, and just more guys. But I've been very, very impressed. There's definitely some, some more things that we need to work on, but we are definitely tightening things up, getting ready for September 7th. But we are looking very good. We just got to focus on the little things, you know, keep, keep improving every day, and that's the, that's the mindset we're going in with everything. You came off a, a big season last year, led this team in tackles, one of the top players in tackles for losses. But what, what were the things that you were wanted to focus on in the offseason to try to improve and get better at going into this year? Just, you know, focusing more on the plays, on the little details, trying to get to the ball, helping my team in any way possible. You know, you say I led the team in tackles, but I'm just trying to do my job and just trying to help us get a win. You know, I think all of 11 of us on the field have to buy in every Saturday night, and that's what it's going to take for us to get a win every Saturday. So just doing the little details and just trying to progress every day and get better. How, how important, you mentioned buying in, how important will that be to this team having a successful season? That's going to be tremendously important. I mean, we've got to buy into our head coach. We've got to buy into the defensive coordinator to get things done. And then overall, I mean, we've got to buy into each other because, you know, at the end of the day, we go out and play the game. So we got to we got to buy into each other. And that's the most important thing. It's very important to us. This is your second year in a coach buff as the D coordinator, but he's also your position coach. He works a lot with the linebackers. What's been his main message to the to you and the guys in your position so far? You know, his thing has just been getting the little details done. You know, last year we we ranked third in the defense. We should have finished first, no matter what the record says. But it's all about buying into the little things, you know. We we want we don't want to make any mistakes. The number one thing that he kind of states on us is play after play after play after play. And, you know, we don't want to let anyone play out because, you know, if you let one play out, then the rest doesn't matter. So we're kind of just trying to buy into the little details, taking it play by play, and just finishing where we left off last season. All right, well, Trey, thanks for the time. We'll see you on the field. All righty, thank you. Go Hawks.